Hi everyone, it's Vicki. Welcome to my channel and I have a stitch fix. It came in a while back. Um, it came in very, very bad shape. There was a slit in the box, a nice clean slit obviously with a knife in the side of the box and um, also the box looked kind of retaped and it was really damaged at the corners. It was in terrible shape. But anyway, um, and inside the box, once I pulled everything out, this item here, which I'll tell you about when I go through all the items, but this item was thrown in the box, or was in the box, I shouldn't say thrown. This item was in there, and then the box that should have been was in there, but they weren't together at all. So I don't know if at the last minute they put these, slid it in, and a hole and slid these in, and then ended up having to retape part of it, because I don't know. Or, I don't know what happened, but this was not in the way that it was intended to come to me. So, let's go through the items. <clears throat> I have my little price list here. And the first item is a pair of very soft, nice joggers. Oh boy, they look pretty big. Yeah, they do. They got nice, what looks like would be loose legs. <laughs> They're really nice, though. Um... <clears throat> I still am suffering from my cold just a little bit. They're by Glider. They're called Merino Jogger in Blue 2X. They are $96. I really like them. That's kind of a lot of money, I think, for a jogger. <coughs> but these are really, really nice quality. They're like a sweater, which might be a bit much for Florida. I don't know. But they would have to have a good fit for me to fall for that. Price tag on a jogger. Okay, so next is a pair of... Liverpool, it says jeans, but they look short to me. They look like crops and they are white, which at one time I was really searching for, kind of gave up on that. <laughs> um, they are Charlie crop wide rolled cuff jeans, but I think they're, they're cuffs. I mean, uh, cro uh, Capri in white 20W99. I feel like I've had these before because they're not really white, white. They're more of a off-white. Uh, you probably can't tell that in the camera. But the same is in this room as in the living room when I open them. Alright, so next is another nice soft top. And it's sweatery. And it is by Bobo. Oh, I'm wearing a Bobo sweater right now in the same soft fabric. But this one, unfortunately, is gray and kind of burgundy, I guess. Two colors I don't really care for and don't look that great in. So um, it's the Barty Hockey Drop sh drop Shoulder Knit Top. So it's not going to look good on me. They call it red in a 2X and it's $54. It's very nice, but the color's going to be wrong for me. And yeah, it is a drop shoulder. The drop shoulders on me are kind of like the raglan sleeves are on me. It's not a good look for me if I don't have, you know, usually pretty defined shoulders like this one. <laughs> And the next item I have is a pair of sneakers, I think they call them. No, they call them walking shoes, which really look nice. These are, what are these? These are <clears throat> Rika Devotion X walking sneakers, black 8.5, $109.99. Where I grew up, we call these tennis shoes. But um, I've already tried these on, just so you know, because I don't really... Do footwear in my videos but they um they fit they're an eight and a half they fit but they I, I can feel sometimes my toe on the on the top of this and like the ones that fit me well are more have the more rounded toes because I have high nail beds and so I don't like stuff pressing against my toes at all and I think if I had socks or even the little sockets or whatever with them, I don't think that these would work. So these are going to go back. And the next item I have is Kate Spade Brilliant Statement Studs in White, $38. Um, <clears throat> they look like this. And I'm going to keep these as a gift going to gift them to somebody so I don't need them but you know it's that time of the year it's perfect and I think they're cute and I think that she would like them so 
I am going to gift these, so I'm going to keep those two. So those are two items you won't see me try on. I wasn't going to try on ear 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 earrings anyway. So let me go try on this top with two different pants, and I'll be right back. Okay, so first the top has nice long sleeves, which is much better than the bobo top I was wearing in the um, beginning. <laughs> that one's a little shy on sleeves. Uh, this has, I couldn't tell before, but this has a scalloped edge, which I think is nice. It's usually flattering. Just a, a rounded neck. A little bit of a wide neck, not terribly wide. Doesn't go down in the back like some plus sizes do. So it's super soft. I really like it. Um, it seems to be kind of oversized, but I guess if you had a turtleneck, maybe that would be okay. I think it looks a little big and sloppy on me. And part of that is this whole drop shoulder look. See how it just, I just become rounded. I don't, yeah. So anyway, I don't think it's super flattering on me and it's definitely not colors that I enjoy or I don't think that I have things that would go with it a lot, you know. I mean, I wouldn't mind gray in pants and stuff, but on the top, not as much. I'm trying to get used to gray, but I just don't like it on me. So, next are the joggers. Well, I can just tell you right now, the joggers are too big. Look at all this. I think they're supposed to be a bit big. They are so incredibly soft and so nicely made, though, that they're so tempting to keep. Um, yeah, they just, look at all this. I think the back side of them fits pretty good because they got a big butt. <laughs> So they're probably not too loose there, but everywhere else, they're even super, super long. Just getting them on. Yeah, see how much they puddle at the bottom. These are 2X, it says. I should check the tags to make sure. But yeah, these run large. So I might see if I can get these in a size down. And the shoes maybe in a size up or half size up. So, But anyway, so I don't know. I got to think about these because these are just too big. And this, uh, I don't know. All right, so let me go try on the white jeans. Okay, even though I would not normally pair these two items together, this gray and burgundy with these off-white pants, I think they look good together, not in the color-wise, but just in the shape of things. And uh, actually, I'm not even sure a sweater would go great with these pants, but um, <clears throat> maybe denim jeans and a sweater like this would go together. I think it has a nice, I don't know, structure together. They seem to, to me to go well together. But the pants. <laughs> First, the fit is just wrong. They're big here. They droop way down. See all that extra right there? Um, the thighs are tight. Yeah, the cut is wrong. Changing the size would not help me because it would probably still have droop because there's that much of it and the thighs would be smaller. Plus, the droop is so much that it's pulling these down and at the waist, although <clears throat> it has a real high waist, but it's creating this, whatever this is called. <laughs> so, yeah, the fit is just, the cut is not right for my body. These are not for me. So, let's see how we end this. <laughs> Oops. You got me in my jammies. <laughs> yeah, I still got, you know, sinuses from this cold or whatever that my husband and I have, and I think we're passing it back and forth to each other. Um, so I took a Benadryl and I thought, you know, I better put on something comfortable because Benadryl knocks me out. I'll be asleep in a half an hour. <laughs> okay, so let's go over my items. All right, so as much as I would love to keep these pants, they don't, they're too big. <clears throat> they are way too big. And yeah, you could wear them oversized and like around the house or something, but not for $96. So I would rather be able to wear them any way I want to at $96. So they are going to go in the back, which I'm not going to do on camera. It'll just save you the noise. Next item is the other bottoms. Yeah, it's a complete misfit, a sizing change would not help. They're just not cut for me, so there's no question these are going back. But I do think they're cute. And I thought that the top, if these were in, you know, different fabrics and colors, 
they would be a good combination together. I thought they were cute together. And then last is the one item that would be of consideration. But even then, I think the fit was a little big for me and this off the shoulder. And I think this is actually red in the print. I think it's the gray that's making it look kind of like a brownish burgundy, not a purple burgundy. And uh, I think if that red was on like say white or something or blue or something or I don't know, anything but gray, it might not, well, not green. <laughs> anyway, I think that it's, it might not be burgundy. I just hate to tell you it's burgundy and when I think it's actually red and that's what it's called. I think in the description is red. Really, really nice top. If you look okay in drop shoulders and a little bit oversized, then yeah, it's really nice. It's nice and soft and would love it. If it had a different cut on it, I would keep it possibly. <laughs> Although how many of these do you need in Florida, right? And I like Bobo products usually. So that's it. The only thing I am keeping are the earrings that I'm going to give away as a gift. So none of the items, I had fit issues on all three clothing, well, all three clothing items and the shoes. <laughs> Thanks for watching the video. I hope you'll give it a thumbs up. I don't even want to show you my nails. They're that bad. And <laughs> hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.